September the 22nd, 1861, Osceola, Missouri. Population 2,000 to 2,500 souls. A beautiful late summer day in Osceola, Missouri. A day that will live forever in the eyes and the hearts of our citizens. School was over for the week and children were playing in the yard. A few fishing in the Osage River, some playing ball at the old ball diamond just over the hill from the town square. The older merchants were closing their stores for the evening and mothers were fixing supper for their families. Most of the young and middle-aged men were away serving in the Missouri State Guard or a home guard of some type. Osceola still seemed to be a safe haven, however, and no one could possibly imagine what was about to take place within the next few hours. Then came Jim Lane's Jayhawkers from Kansas. War was on in Osceola. The courthouse was shelled. Twelve men were shot execution style on the town square. Homes and businesses were set afire, and within the next two days, the entire town, with the exception of a few homes, was totally destroyed. Blood mixed with tears marked the spot which only a few short hours before had been a town with peaceful, contented, happy homes. September the 24th, 1861, population 183 the beautiful city of Osceola, Missouri, never to be the same.